All right, Shalom. I want to give all praise and honor glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Rahak Kodash. Help honor the apostles and the elders, that great millstone who will well. Peace and blessings to the hopeful elect that are pushing his work throughout the four corners, doing his work in truth and sincerity. I want to say Shalom. And uh, our Lord will in this video is edifying. And this is just something on my mind that crossed, crossed my mind um, on the fact that this is a pretty much a uh 24 hour job you know uh one is serving the heavenly father uh through his son and uh uh the brotherhood and your personal life hey these are these are uh 24 hour jobs you know meaning what it doesn't stop all right no matter what uh, Satan does to try to take you off your course. You got to keep going. You know, so this is the book of Baruch chapter 4 and 28. It says, for as it was your mind to go astray from the most high, so being returned, seek him 10 times more. You know, so this is one of my favorite, favorite scriptures because it takes me back uh, to the world where I was lacking the knowledge, uh, wisdom and understanding of the Lord, you know, I was I was lacking that uh, along with you other sincere believers, the true believers, you were lacking that. So once, uh, so so once they uh, the apostles and elders, you heard them preaching. You seek you uh you were seeking them ten times more, ten times you know. So when you think of ten times, hey, you think of. Hey, going going to the max, and how do you do that? Looking up words, looking up words, looking up articles, uh, measuring the time diligi uh, diligently, as the scriptures say. You want to keep doing these things so you stay in the good graces, the good graces of the Lord. You know, and then once and and, and that's supplicating. When you're when you're doing that, you're supplicating with the Lord. You know, you're doing these things that he loves. You're doing the things that he uh, uh, he, he he approves of, you know, so because once you're idle, you can you can veer off to do uh, doing pretty much uh, whatever. Uh, you can go to, uh, 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 go get on the Internet, start looking up uh, folly, going to the gym, hooking up with uh, people in the world, things of that nature. So in the back of your mind, it, you know, it should click all the time that, hey, I should be, uh, I should be getting on my grind for the Lord, uh, uh, trying to cash in these tokens, you know, so this is the book of, uh, Isaiah, see, so this guy next to me in the car, he not seeking the Lord, he's playing his, you know, he, he's probably on, on some, uh, trying to get on that tonight you know so this is the book of uh isaiah chapter uh, 55 verse 6 it says seek ye the lord while he may be found call ye upon him while he is near all right so especially who are first coming into this thing like i once was we see the lord and we and we seek we seek after him while we may, we may be found because there's going to come a time in a period where he's not going to be here me meaning the scriptures the volume of the book it's not going to no, no longer be here you know what i'm saying so we can seek him we can go through the scriptures we can get on youtube and we can uh look up uh other diligent brothers videos yeah uh, you can get a notification on if they made a video or not and um you know if they going live and and, he, and you can be fed uh spiritually fed that's why i named this channel uh, uh letters to the flock you know because the letters the apostles in the ancient world when they would write letters it would be to the churches it would be um a letters to the churches uh maybe uh, exhortation and other things uh, uh, as far as communication-wise goes.
So this is the book of Second Peter, chapter one and ten. And this is Saturday night. You know, this is this is the height in the height time. What? Nine twenty three. You know, what I'm saying, you know, you know, you know, these uh, skeezers out here. You know, these these women are out here looking to get into something. And it's, there's, 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 there's necessarily nothing wrong with that. But you have to put uh, Yahweh Bashim Yahshai first. So this is Second Peter's chapter, Second Peter chapter one and ten. Wherefore the ra the rather brethren give diligence to make your calling and election sure, for if you do these things, ye shall never fall. So you shouldn't fall if you're abiding by this. Like I mentioned earlier, as far as diligence, as far as being on your watch, being on your post, as you're commanded to be. That's how you make your election sure. So so your mentality is, OK, since I'm doing this, I know that the Lord is dealing with me. I, I'm doing what he told me to do. So. He's going to be dealing with me, he's going to be I'm going to have high favor with the Lord. And let's say you do fall, let's say it says ye shall never fall. So if you do fall. Uh, the scriptures also say. Um, a righteous man shall fall uh, seven times but get back up. So if you do fall, you'll still have the strength to get back up and continue. And continue on those uh, uh, on your journey. You know, and it's, you know, it's not going to uh, discourage you as much because there is pitfalls and, and obstacles um, that are set um um uh there there's obstacles set against us in this world but the, the first we didn't we don't have the spirit of fear like the uh scriptures say and for two we we forsaken this world so all we have is this the truth you know so uh lord willing this was the edifying video i'm gonna give all praises honor and glory to yahweh Bashim Yahweh Shai, Bashim Rachakwadash, the bodice of the apostles and the elders at Great Millstone. Shalom to you, Akim out there. Shalom.